Welcome to another of one of my beer reviews. My name is Zeb. And my name is Daniel. And on this fine evening, we're drinking uh, an up top IPA from J Dub's Brewing Company in Sarasota, Florida, which is 6.5% alcohol. Hmm. And I'm going to see how long I can go without looking, looking at Zeb. Probably not very long. I have a habit of doing it. Yeah. Hmm. Sudsy. How you doing there? Fine. Probably better than you. Probably. Mm-hmm. What? What the? Deuce? <laughs> oh, I just looked at you. Oh, yeah. no! Oh, no! Oh, well. Um, yeah, for some reason I can't seem to get a pour <laughs> to go right. It always gives me... I think he shakes a can up before he gives it to me. No, I don't. Well, very uh, IPA in color. Yeah, it's, like a, mine's a little hazy. I poured the bottom into mine, but yeah, I didn't get that far. Um, I'm gonna call it a light straw. Yeah, light straw. That's Looks what, nice. That's what I was gonna say. Got a thick, foamy head. Yeah, mine's got like a two-finger white head. Ooh. Smells uh, hoppy. It does. You know, um, grapefruit. Yeah, citrus, floral. So, yeah, a little bit different. Something yeah, different something here. a little different. Like, um, I don't know if I like that differentness. Juniper, maybe. Something like twisted juniper. I don't know. What the hell does that mean? <laughs> I don't know. It's kind of weird. Something weird. I don't know. Shlanta. Shlanta. Let us drink. A little bitter. Grainy. Looking pretty standard IPA ness. Yeah. It's nothing crazy, but um it's not too bitter, which is how I like my IPAs. Mm -hmm. It does kind of kick in right there at the finish all of a sudden. It makes your tongue shrink a little bit. Yeah, it's got um, it's got good flavors though. Yes. I like it. Yeah, it's cool. It is kind of like standard fair IPA flavors. You know, like grapefruit, mm -hmm. a little pine, some graininess. Yeah, nothing out of the ordinary. No, but it's good. It is good. I guess that sums it up. It's good. Yeah. Um, <laughs> Mouthfeel. Sticky? Yeah. Is that what you were thinking? I was. Hmm. I was just going to say that and then you said it. Good. I really was. I believe you. Uh, I think it's very drinkable. Again, it's not super bitter, which is good and how I like my IPAs. Yeah. I mean... The flavors are, you know, right on. I mean, yeah, it's, it is fine. If you're an IPA person, I think you, I think you'll enjoy this. Let's, what do they say? It doesn't slap you in the face with bitterness. Negatron. This one inspires you to. What does that mean? I don't know. Like <laughs> negative? Find your closest pals or the person next to you at the bar and give them a big hole. Up, up top. top. It's a high five. Oh. Okay. I would have just been like up top. Just yell it at people. <laughs> That's good. Big old up top. Um, I don't really have much else to say about it. It's a good IPA. If you can get it, you should try it. If you like IPAs, yeah. I almost feel like I'm kind of boring because yeah, there wasn't know, anything like, really to. There's nothing. On. There's nothing out of the ordinary. It's it is good and fine. Like good IPA. Yeah. Do you have a do you have a rating? I'm giving it a four or five. Me too. Um, only on the basis that there's nothing, there's nothing blowing me away in it. It's really good. Yeah. It's just also like really standard, which is not bad. I think not it's a bad thing. I think it's a very well done beer. And I found something a little a little odd in the aroma. Yeah, yeah, sure. I can get behind that. What that was. So, but other than that, you know, yeah. yeah. Good stuff. Obviously drinking it, <laughs> which I will continue to do so. 
Indeed. All right, so a rapid pace. That's it. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns, please leave them below or send us an email. Uh, subscribe if you like what we're doing. Until next time, cheers. Cheers. <laughs>